What's up, y'all? It's your boy. I am Mr. TTO. Today, the topic we'll be talking about Dodge Durango SRT. Um, thanks to all my fans and all my supporters for all the support and love. Um, thank y'all for the motivation for making me do these videos. Um, let's get to the video. Um, how I personally feel about the Dodge Durango myself. Um, they some different. They stand outside the box. Um, they big. They very fast for their size. Personally, would I buy one if I had the money for one? I would because they some different. But I want to keep it for that long. But this is the only year that they will be making the Dodge Durango. So if you can find them after this year. That's good because personally, they said they probably won't be making no more after this year. So, what I would say is, if you want one, try to go and find one. Because how many they said they were going to make? I think 100 or 50. Quote me if I'm wrong. But, um, personally, on that, it just, I would want to do something different with mine from a lot of people um i would want to get a lifted i would want to try something different that's standing outside the box um what i mean by that is this um you can't just live your life being normal you feel me you always got to stand outside the box think different do things different however you want to do it find it out um i like the speed of a dodge durango i like how fast they is like a lot of people be thinking like hellcats are faster than dodge durango they are but up in force the dodge durango have the hellcat the red eye on the jump they got them on the jump got them on the jump all the way dodge durango got the jump um so personally from my perspective i think a dodge durango probably is like one of the most fastest produced cars that dodge have ever made from myself like from the takeoff standpoint they are the fastest that i know of but what i can say from seeing the dodge durango actually race um, they done raced a lot of vehicles a lot so coming from that it's like you have to know how much power that your car is producing and you got to know how to control a car like that um the quality the inside the interior the outside i like the aggressive grill that it has on it um that's something very outstanding um quality level of the speech of how it talks um the wine because it's a lot that comes with a car that has that much power so you have to know how to control a car like that you can know how to control a honda all day but with seven seven hundred and ten horsepower that's a lot of horsepower for family sedan so it will be different to see something like that actually moving that fast and quickly with that much quality level instinct um but what i can say on that vehicle is like you just can't think that every car will be same will be the same because every vehicle have their own ways their own quality their own standpoint you feel me i can't say a hellcat is like a dodge durango i can't say a wide body like a slim body um but that dodge durango personally what I really like about it, how big it is, 
like no homo. How big it is because the size of it, it let itself be known. Let itself be known. It uh, that's what it do. Because being honest, I haven't seen a Dodge Durango in person, but I will. Um, but when I actually see one, I'm gonna be making a lot of videos on one content. Um, what's coming up, man? Y'all gotta stay tuned. I will probably up in my next video. Will be showing my OBS truck. Probably be doing my first review on my truck. So, y'all stay tuned for that. Um, but I can say yeah, it is a good sedan, family sedan. If you looking for speed and power. But if you don't want that speed and power, it's not a very good vehicle for you, to be honest, because it holds a lot of power and strength. So, if you're not ready to handle all that, it's not the car for you, you feel me? So, everything that comes with it, you just have to learn. You just have to learn the car, you have to respect the car, you feel me? So... Saying that is, and then go to zero to 60. I don't know they zero to 60 offhand, but I know they pretty fast to zero to 60 that I know of. So, when I actually get more better at the information and everything like that, I will be letting y'all know on all that. I probably will be making another video on this because I know this ain't my best, but Y'all already know, it's your boy, I am Mr. TTO, so y'all already know what's finna be going on, you feel me? A lot finna be coming up for my channel and my content. So everything that's finna be coming, man, y'all gotta stay tuned for. Y'all gotta st to stay tuned for, you feel me? So, saying that, um, probably finna be clocking out, you feel me? So... Man, it's your boy. I am Mr. TTO, man. If y'all like the video, put a thumbs up. Uh, share, like, subscribe, you feel me? So, this is just the beginning for me on YouTube. So, y'all already know what's finna be coming. Man, it's your boy. I am Mr. TTO, man. I'm clocking out, man. You feel me? Yes, sir.